Often testing is about more than just what you test. A lot of people care about and have a stake in the quality of a project. Development and test managers might care about the quality of the parts of the project that you're responsible for. Other testers and developers working on a project might be interested in the quality to help them understand what things to consider in their day-to-day -day work. And sometimes even senior managers or executives are interested in understanding the current status of testing on a project. Of course, there can be a danger to just reporting on numbers about passing and failing rates on a project, and so having some more detailed insights can be helpful. Test Project provides some easy and powerful reporting tools that can help you understand how your test automation is performing. For example, when running tests, the reports offer ways to quickly and easily understand test failures and dig into them. For example, if we look at this failing test here, we can see that it's got screenshots and other useful information that helps us understand what's going on. And we can even toggle this here to show only the failing steps so that we can more easily dig in and understand what's happening. But there's more to test reporting than just understanding what went wrong so that you can fix it. As a tester, you will also often need to let others know how things are going. Test Project gives you a lot of insight into these kind of things as well. For example, a helpful feature that Test Project has is the ability to download a test report as a PDF. This is really helpful for sharing information with others about the testing that has been done. Another important part of test automation is understanding test trends over time. Seeing how passing and failing rates change across a project or even for a particular test over time can help us understand where there might be issues and how to focus our time. Sometimes there are differences in our products based on the platform that tests are run on. For example, there might be differences between running on Windows or Macs or perhaps even on different mobile platforms. Test Project gives you a nice summary view of what this looks like so that you can understand what's going on with your tests on different platforms. Also, if you're running your tests across multiple agents, it will show you how the test is doing on each agent. Within each platform, we can also have further breakdowns where we might look at different browsers, for example. Once again, out of the box, Test Project gives us instantaneous insights into this. There are also some other helpful features like search and the ability to filter results to different date ranges. You can also drill in and look at these reports either at a full project level or per test or even for some of the data per execution of a test. As you can see, Test Project has a rich and robust set of functionality that you can use when reporting on your testing.